shit! Oh my god, he's reacting to a beatbox again. Dice vs. Robin, loop station battles. You guys know I love these loop station battles. Usually at least once I get out of my seat a little bit, or at least I go... Will that happen today? I don't know. I don't know. I'm feeling pretty grounded today. I don't think anything in this battle is really gonna shock me. I don't think anything is gonna get me hyped like that. I don't have any energy today. It's a lie. Dice vs. Robin. I don't know if I checked out Dice before. I've definitely checked out Robin. If I'm not mistaken, he has kind of a melodic style a lot of times in, in his, like, he'll sing a lot during his sets. I don't, could be wrong about that, but I'm pretty sure I'm not wrong about that. But the beautiful thing about this video is even though we get hyped watching the drops and watching how everything is building up, I break it down from a music production perspective. Because if you're here for the first time, my name is Joey Nato. I'm actually a rapper, a music producer, and a, um... YouTuber. Also a Twitch streamer. Streaming over on Twitch. We play games like this. Check this out. First off, <clears throat> please address me as Aria and not Drone Lady. Do you see what I see? Waifu activated. Is it bad that I love her? I'll be in touch tomorrow with more details. Now, when you say in touch, what do you mean by touch? This train has private rooms, which I imagine Yuna is using right now. Do you want to use one? What'd you think? <laughs> I know. And hey, if you want to support this channel and watch some uncut anime reactions, I know that's random on a video like this. But if you want to support the channel, you can do so over on Patreon. Shouts to all these beautiful people over on Patreon, supporting the channel, supporting what we do. A cow goes moo. How do you do? That's what happens when you do over 500 videos over the course of years and you just run out of things. That, no, it's over 900 videos, I think. Something like that. It's, it's stupid. You run out of things to say. Luckily, these beatboxers don't have to say anything today. All they gotta do is put their talents out there. And as long as Simon Cowell isn't one of the judges, they, they should be Gucci and the Coochie. Can I say Coochie on YouTube? Well, I just did. Lucky Squad, never give up. Let's get into it. I see a little silhouette of a man. Scaramouche, Scaramouche, will you do that? Something? What the hell do they say during that part? I don't know. Am I going to heaven? I'm seeing a light right now. This is all that's in my screen. It's just, it's just white. I guess that's what my wife wakes up to every morning when she looks at me. That's, that, that's crazy. I feel bad for her now. All right, let's, uh, let's get into it. Let's begin. I'm not ready. It's like a jump scare, dude. What the hell? Let's begin. Hit him with the glitch. <laughs> Oh yeah, this one took place in Tokyo. Bro, okay, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Bro, that was just the intro and I've already- Bro, you saw the faces I was making? That was just the intro! I'm not- I'm- I'm, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna fucking die. Represented for Korea. Korea? Oh, they got the translator? Lit. Lit. That's one thing about beatbox. It don't need no translation! <laughs> My boy just came on stage with some sweatpants. He rolled out of bed to just whoop some ass. I like it. Shoes on for this thing. Next up versus the lion. Like a real lion? Ooh la la. Ooh la la. You might have seen him in the French championship taking a W. Bro, I thought he just said you might have seen him. The French W like taking a dump. I thought he said taking it. Bro. Taking a W. <laughs> I, th I thought he was about to say that. I'm just saying. Make some noise once again. Amazing for stage. Robin. If you don't know how to make chords, this is it. This is awkward. <laughs> Congratulations. That's me. Well, this is a first. The cards are already made for you. 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 Fucking sheep. Fucking sell out. I mean, it was a pretty cool chord pack. Not gonna lie. Oh my God, the bass. All right, we gotta lower this a little bit. So we'd appreciate maybe you it. Got, maybe it was the note. Uh, <laughs> okay, sorry. Bro. All right, Robin versus Dice right here, live in the rack, GBB 2023, Tokyo. Are you ready? Yeah, let's get it. Robin, I say the twa, you say the dun na uh. In twa. Duh, nah. Oh, duh, uh. Beep, can I try? Okay. 
Bro, that swing right there. <laughs> it almost sounds like New Jack swing right off the bat. That's what I get right out of this. You know, like that that uh, early 90s, late 80s R&B type style. It reminds me of that right there because those hi-hats, it has a swing to it. That You see, I like the swing. It swing is very hard to describe, but. Hello, my dear guys. I'm Robbie. You look very nice, but I'm sorry. <laughs> you look very nice, but I'm sorry. On the downbeats, he has a little bass. He's not talking shit, he's singing shit. All right, so he's doing kind of like a doo-wop type thing here with this harmony. He got three minutes to cook here? If he has three minutes, he has time to play around like this. This doesn't even have to be part of the, the entire composition that he's doing. He could just do this as like a little intro. I'm invested. It's almost like a little staccato trumpet. I'm getting too, too hyped. Falsetto. Da -da -da. That's the falsetto right there. He keeps layering the harmony. This is so unique. Bro, he's really doing like a doo-wop. He's like creating a doo-wop quartet. This is pretty cool. And he's falling in a chromatic scale a little bit. That's a chromatic fall right there, so. We're really riding with this? I mean, he keeps saying you're very nice. You look very nice. I don't know if Dice could understand what he's saying. Forget the first pass. <laughs> wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, are we gonna flip this? Cause he gave that. He gave that look at the crowd. Like this is this is what I've been building up to. Are we gonna like, I feel like the bass is coming in soon. I feel like the bass is coming in soon. I can feel it. I can feel it. What? That reminds me of something. Oh! System of the down, right? You know I'm t I'm drawing a blank, but. <laughs> oh, shit! What? What? Oh my god. What a set bro, that's fucking genius. We completely went from doo-wop in the fucking 1930s with flappers and dudes wearing suits and cigars and wearing cigars. You know what I'm trying to say. We went from that to some new age heavy synth bass. That was a synth bass, emulating a synth bass with his voice, of course. Ding 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 ding. And then it's four to the floor, so kick, snare, kick. Snare, but with the kick on the snare beats too. Bro, whoo! Hi hats. Little electric block on that. Oh, there's high notes too. Long legato notes here. Emulating a high. A mono synth. I pretty much broke down everything that you need to know about this. Oh, these chill mellow chords. Emulating like a, uh, I guess a pad. A 
tad with these really subtle chords. Oh, brightening them up. That beat drop is insane. That is insane. Yup, yup. Brought it right back. Gotta remember where you came from. Oh my god, I missed this. I missed this. Dice, you better have something. <laughs> Robin. You better have something. The tone in round one. With the response, we got Dice from Korea, making sure that we can take these lights down so we can see his actual Push trigger and everything. Get the lights down, the lights down. Show Set the mood. Show me a little bit. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Let's see what he has for the response. You already know what to do. Left side. Strong kicks. I know he's just warming up, but th th those strong kicks, they're punching through. I say the set, you say the dole in the hana. In set. I'm sorry, what? You already know what to do. Left side, right side. I say the set, you say the dole in the hana. In set. Akuma Matata. They almost sound like like drops of water, right? Boing, boing. It's because of that the kind of texture that's on the the tip of the sound. It's the, it's called the attack, the beginning of the sound. But anyways, I like how it's kind of uh, modulated a little bit. It's got the wobbly feel. A lot of that is coming from the delay or the echo on it. Mama. It's just a really quick sixteenth note delay that's bouncing off of it. A little bit of a uh, room reverb on there. Okay. See, that's a that's a slow attack. It sounds so ominous. The, the low notes humming here. Ooh, yeah, the little drops are coming in, panning left to right. Nice snare. The snare got a delay on it too, or the, the echo. So every time he goes, that's a hi hat, and every time he goes, that's an open hat. Because the hi hat is really a closed hat. That's another way to put it. Close hat. Open hat. I don't know why I tried to do it like that. I can't. It's impossible to do a hi hat while saying the word hi hat. This one's got a nice rhythm to it. I like it. Ooh. Almost like a little toms he created there. Now a strong hum there. Ooh, he got a dope kind of low voice. Nice harmony. I feel like they almost had a similar approach with this, uh, with this, with their intro. I feel like we're going to get two fake out. I feel like, you know how like Robin faked out the crowd with how he did his job for that job. I still remember the melody. Din, 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 din. Dan, 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 dan. That shit was hard. But I feel like Dice has something here. I feel like Dice is gonna roll something out. That was, there's a reason why I do that above the table. Okay, so you can see where my. Ooh, falsetto harmony put in there. Ooh! Ooh! Isn't that called like throat bass or something like that in the beatbox? Like bass something like that? Well, what it's emulating is a, um, it, I mean, it's a throaty type of 
synth bass there, but it's a... Uh, that'd be square, right? That'd be a square wave. The texture of that bass is crazy. And there was that hard kick that I heard in the beginning that he could do, but I love how he has that short cut off. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow, wow. And it's just making it like cut through better. Singing these high notes now. He was doing a similar melody but lower notes earlier. There's some fuzziness in there. I like it. I love that distortion in there. He's got a good bounce. Ooh, left the kick out on the drop. Oh, that little arpeggiator right there. Basically an arpeggiator. It basically takes a sequence of notes, repeats it over and over. But it's so effective. See, I'm gonna keep it real though. Oh, the bass is amazing. This shit is hard. But Robin won that one. His dice was super creative. It was cool. It was ominous. It was creepy. It had a dope drop. But Robin's was so left field in the tempo of his for that. Din, 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 din. I still remember it. That's rare. That's rare that I'll like go this long with remembering one of the melodies from one of these sets. But anyways, yeah, the tempo of Robin's for the drop, it just got the crowd so hyped. And he already got the crowd like really into it. Robin definitely wins that round right Going what's next Robin. buddy crowd left side right side i say the twa you say the doing the uh, let's get it in twa bonjour beatbox i do my own thing where are we going with this rhythm oh we're doing drum and bass okay i like it Almost sounds like a metronome there, but that block sound. Bling, bling, bling. Then some shakers were put in there on top of the hi-hats. That's the hi-hat, and then... Shakers. A little staccato. Ooh. Little staccato notes climbing. Going off the beat here with another staccato note underneath. Of course, we're layering it, layering it. He loves harmonies. He loves harmonies. Ooh. Subby bass. Oh, mm, okay. We kept good sending. You got me. You got me, Robin. Open. Hey, keep it going. Okay, so the thing about Robin, he doesn't have the craziest voice, singing voice, but his timing. He understands timing and he understands melodic structure. He understands how to compose his pieces to sound like an actual song. You know what I mean? With layering with harmonies, layering with all these different instruments. And his timing. He knows when to when to put the vocal in just so it's it's effective. Do what you're gonna do. That's a super loud hi hat. R R. 
Oh, that's a strong vocal. Shut the fuck up, Joey. The boy can sing. Oh my God. That sounds amazing. Oh my god, th th these videos make me make faces that I'm not proud of. I'd be going from... to... <laughs> Bro, one of these faces has got to make the thumbnail. If we didn't do- if we didn't do the freaking thing that we do in our videos, our little trademark thing, where I pose, and then we freeze it during the video, and then we show the thumbnail during the video- Bro, if we don't do that for this, shame on us. Missed opportunity. These type of faces can't be replicated. You hear that? It's almost like they, uh, he- he created a woodwind type instrument. Like a flute or something. But no one- I'm, I don't know anybody that really played a flute that fast, where it's like- like, like running down again an arpeggiated sequence dice did one Robin answers with another one Bum 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 with the bass line bum 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 Bro that shit is crazy That's a very popular pop song technique right there. You come back in with just the acapella or just one little thin layer of the instrument underneath and then the second measure, boom. That's when you come back in with the with the rhythm section, with the drums and the and the, and the bass. No pun intended. <laughs> Ooh, he put in little chords in there. And he's singing that vocal live, bro. He's killing it. He shut me the fuck up with what I said about the singing. Open hat. Building up with the open hat. Eighth notes. That arpeggiated sequence is higher now. Higher octave. He boosted it up an octave. Oh, perfect. Die off, too. Dice, you better have something crazy. Who is this bitch with her legs open? What is happening? I don't understand. I'm watching beatbox reactions. All of a sudden, there's a porno. There's literally the number 69 next to her head. What is this, bro? What is happening? What has happened to our generation, okay? Why can't I just watch a good old-fashioned Tokyo loop station beat battle between Korea and France? Why can't I get through that without getting ads shoved in my face, vagina shoved? shoved in my face and 69 shoved in my face okay there's a time and a place for it right now at 7 20 in the morning when i'm doing a reaction video for youtube is not the time okay fuck this up with her teeth and now she just threw up i don't understand what life is with the response last round coming back the sad thing is i'll probably do a sponsor for that game at some point th this year those mobile games they be flooding my emails about sponsor opportunities so i'm probably gonna do a sponsor for hero wars so look out for that your boys a sellout let's get it dice you better have something crazy coming back on dice Making sure we keep those lights down so we can go and see if we take those lights down, my friends. I'd appreciate that. Bro is so dumb with the light so people. Much. This host does not f with the light people. I say the set, you say the dull Nahana. Dice is on you. In set. Done. Beatbox. Done. I'm lost. Oh, even stronger kicks now. Ooh. That's like a retro clap right there. So there's a drum machine called the Roland 8808. Ah, uh, I hope I'm getting that right. It's a very classic drum machine, like like uh, you know, like a lot of Prince songs. Think of um, when doves cry. You know how the drums play in the beginning of that. It has like those little sharp, short claps with the short release on them. That's kind of like what he emulated there. Oh, okay. We got some tempo. 
surprise effect. Ooh, you mixed in some little percussion in there. Ding, 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 ding. That, that. Shinke. Shinke. Robin killed my house. Shinke house. House. Robin killed my house. Shinke house. Okay, little like uh, electric times there. Boom, boom, boom. I love this vibe that he's going with. The, the slow attack on the bass there. Obviously the vocal chop. Dap, dap. House. House. This is hard. Ooh, turn it into four to the floor. He made this house basically, house music. Okay. Okay, that 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 mono synth melody is hard. This guy's a fucking hater. This guy right here, this guy, that's probably me. That's gonna be at one of these events in in in, in 20 years. This guy's a fucking hater. Why aren't you vibing? Vibe with this shit. Bro already decided in his mind that Robin won. Robin didn't win yet. Robin didn't win yet. This guy's a hater, man. This guy's drinking all the hater aids. Got the crowd into it. Ooh, the zaps! <laughs> Bro, I love those two-toned, harsh synths there that have a subbiness to them, a very strong low end, but then a piercing high note layered right on top of it. It's always so effective, and it's 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 actually a uh, a staple for um for house music, specifically for the uh, the synth basses that are used, bro. <laughs> Ooh, taking the breaks from that melody for the zaps is genius. Because this sa same melody over and over could get annoying, so you take a break. Bass got dropped out. Ooh, interesting harmony on the voice there. You can do rap harmonies, they don't have to be all singing. House. All right, playing with the mid, the, the mid range there. Almost sounds like a Wurlitzer a little bit with those notes, which is the type of electric piano. Oh! Oh, that fall, the pitch fall there. His presentation. <laughs> yes. Dice has some innovative shit, bro. Really innovative shit. And it's no secret to you guys who watch these reactions from me. Uh, one of my favorites to watch is So-So because it's so different. It's so unique. You know what I mean? Like, the, such unorthodox sounds. Like, how the hell did you think to do that? You know what I mean? That's what I like. That's what blows me away a lot of times. You know, I, I, I like a little nice, simple bass drop too you know what i mean it's just like everybody else just like all the simpletons out there but yeah whenever it's the unique sounds and unique choices and unorthodox rhythms and stuff like that that's what blows me away dice kind of got that right now oh that's it he didn't even need to use all the time he didn't even need all the time what's this what this fucking hater doing bro what's this hater doing in the front bro yeah, that's definitely me in a few years. I mean, his hairline is already me now, so it's, you know. I'm going hard on this guy. I know nothing about him. Yep, Dice killed it on that last one. 
Robin, I invite you up to the front of the stage. Robin won it. I invite you up to the front of the stage. Once again, we go to our esteemed judging panel. Robin won it. In three, two, one. Give it up for Robin! Was that unanimous? Give it up yeah. for Robin! Hit him with the glitch. Insane. Insane. But you have certainly not seen the last of this young gentleman. Dice had nice game. pants, but Dice Robin is from France. Crazy round. Crazy round. Yeah, that was fucking dope. That was lit. Yo, I'm Robin. Thank you for watching this video. You can talk? You can find me on Instagram on Robin Beatbox. <laughs> What have we learned today? Drop in the comments if you learned something today. What did I learn? I learned I need to react to more beatbox and loop station. Because literally every time I do it, I have the f***ing time of my life. Sometimes, I'm not going to lie. Sometimes it's like, it's a little stressful for me. Because, you know, my reputation is to break this down. You know what I mean? So I'm like, whenever I see that time marker, I'm like, 20 minute video of just straight analyzing. Like, that's a lot of, it's a lot of mental work. Especially for me, for someone who had a one point for GPA in high school. You know what I mean? So I had to like, you know, so I gotta be in a certain mood to react to this shit. But that was crazy. That was hard. Tell me what I need to react to next. Tell me what I need to react to next and I will do it. I'll be your reaction whore. All right, appreciate you guys watching. <laughs> I'll see you in the next one. Had a feeling I would pop out on these bitches while I, nah, 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 I'm never chilling motherfucker while I. For a tough, now the weekly nine nah, nah. Ask me what is coming up, that's a secret, yeah, yeah I was cooped up, now I'm souped up, yeah, I'm loving my life I just get up and just do it, I'm just saying why I try you